Hey guys, what's up? It's Mick Bucksauce, and welcome back to my survival world in Hardcore Minecraft. Here we go. Uh, today, instead of going to the nether, like I said, and kind of upgrading my armor, my diamond armor, to netherite, and my iron chest plate, which I need diamond for that, and I also need mending. Because I don't have mending on my uh, other chest plates that I have kind of saved up in my house. Since we have part one of the cave update released, I thought why not kind of venture out and why am I carrying rotten flesh? I have plenty of this stuff. I don't need it. I can get more of those from my zombie farm slash drown farm, which now can give me copper ore, which is pretty cool. Oh, oh! is that a Vindicator with the banner? Oh, he's really close. He's creeping closer to my village, and I don't like that at all. And he's fast, which is the other problem, too. Uh, what can I do? If he just keeps going that way... If I don't stand too close to him, hopefully he shouldn't see the villagers in uh, the village. And I wonder if he's spawn. I don't know if they can spawn inside within the torches. If they are hostile mob, but he is kind of just wandering around the terrain, going into the taiga right there. So I'll let him do his thing. I'll keep an eye on him. One of the things I wanted to check out, though, is... Uh, for some moss blocks um, and I know I can find some of those in shipwrecks uh, I have to kind of venture out to areas that I haven't been to in this world which I have maps kind of lot I don't even know if I I don't have maps fully kind of unlocked or whatever I have a few maps but I've been to other locations that I haven't haven't have had a I can't say it that I haven't had a map with me, so I'm gonna kinda guess where I need to go and head to to hopefully find I'm looking for some amethyst because I'd like to make the tainted glass and then I'd like to make that spyglass, which is super cool. Let's zoom in on objects and such. And I kinda looked at that in creative mode and I gotta get my hands on one of those things, so. But at first I wanna come down here because I know a lot of the times we have. We have wandering traders that like to spawn, and I'm not sure, but I believe they might be able to. Okay, here's a llama. All right, they might be able to sell me moss, and that llama nearly died. So these guys were here last time. I might need to kind of wait around, but I don't really want to wait around the same time but this is the villager breeder that I have set up right now it is kind of slow the villagers kind I mean they do work but they don't they haven't really wanted to breed too well I did get two villagers one of the things to kind of speed up the process is I got two right there it's just putting beds inside there and having those guys breed with each other and I don't know if they need to trade they might just breed on their own but they are going slow, so an iron farm will take a little bit of time, but I mean, if I kind of grind for that and kind of AFK for a while, hopefully that'll work. So what am I doing? I don't need a bucket, because so I'm thinking we're going to head to the ocean and search for the amethyst geodes. Yeah, whenever we find a wanting trainer, we can test it out. But if we find a shipwreck, that would be even cooler. Uh, Alright, so what I'm going to need, I need a boat. And I have a boat. Uh, I have a shock box, and I have more in my ender chest. So we're good on storage, just in case we get full. My pick is still good. Should upgrade that guy. And should upgrade the silk touch one with mending. I need to upgrade. But I've just kind of <laughs> procrastinated a little bit. Alright, so one of the things I need, I want some night vision potions. So for that, I need some carrots. 
There's a llama, but I believe that's just a regular old little llama wandering around. I should sleep too, because I don't want phantoms to start coming after me. I don't really know when the last time I slept was, but I should do that. Because I need to come inside anyways to grab carrots. Um, and I have a farm outside, but... Kind of a manual farm, but we're going to sleep. And then... Gold. I need some gold. Uh, yeah, those are my zombies. Alright, is it this? I think it's golden nuggets. I believe it's golden nuggets. Hopefully. Hopefully. Eight. Hey. Get there. Thank you. And then I guess I'll just do the golden carrot now. So we need a golden carrot, and then the rest of the stuff that I have, it's a wild fox. No, it's my fox pet. Uh, carrots, let's guess. Good. Alright, so we just need one carrot. So we can get three out of this. And then, right here, golden carrot. Good to go. We got that set. And then we're going to set those to eight minutes, just because. And I don't I think I need water breathing potions. Do I have any? Layout. And then potions. Alright, maybe we might have water breathing. There we go. So we do have water breathing. And I might as well pull one out. I'll put this here. We'll pull one out because we might need that. Nope. We gotta put it back in here. Alright. And. Nah, I was gonna I was gonna bring elytra, but I don't think I need any, and I don't have. I just only have raw fish, obviously. Ah, uh, my inventory. Oh, I don't like a full inventory, but this is what we're going to do. I gotta stop being organized and eat. Just do it. Okay, so next we got to go into the Nether. All right, so we have a bunch of water bottles. Do I have anything in here? Nothing in there. So we need one, two, three awkward potions because I've already set these up. They're ready to go. Eventually, we'll make this all beautiful and good and automated. I don't really know why I have this set up in the nether because I have to keep on traveling out and it's just annoying. All right. Is it just a golden apple? I mean a golden carrot. And then to increase the time. Alright, TNT or no, gunpowder does splash. So I believe it's redstone. Hopefully we will find out what are these weakness. I wonder where I got those from. I probably crafted those. And do have fire resistance for when we need to go. Alright, night vision three. And this should bring them all to eight. Should be plenty. All I'm really looking for is the nether, uh, is the uh, amethyst geodes, which I guess the best way to find them is traveling through the ocean. So what I will do is probably head past my guardian temple slash farm that I'm still working on, and my creeper farm that I'm still working on. And we have eight here. So there we go. We have eight. Plenty. And that should be all we need. My pick is good, so we can mine some of these up. So once I find another geode, if I can find one, if I can exit the nether. Alright, so let's see. I need my boat out with me. So we're going to go. We're going to head out past this way. Keep going into the ocean. And then when I get kind of far enough. I think there is a island out past the creeper farm. And then I don't think I really traveled much further after that. And this ice is starting to close in on me. There we go. Still enough room. And we have a dolphin friend. Hello dolphin friend. How are you doing? Alright, so we're getting close. Can't really see the temple. Oh, we can kind of see the temple off just above me. And there's the dirt that I have set around it. And then I'm going to add all the fence gates. A lot of wood. 
it's gonna be a lot of wood. And basically, no, actually, my plan was to uh, add soul sand all along the bottom. Basically, they're gonna flow up to the. Wait, 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 wait. hold on. Was that an axolotl? <gasps> Ooh, axolotl. Do I have a bucket on me? No, no, no. Get out of there. Oh, yeah, I could breathe. I could make a bucket. Ox I thought axolotls could only spawn in caves. Why are they here anyways? I want one, so we will grab a bucket. Why? I don't want this here. Get out of here. We'll make two buckets because there are two there. Look at that. That's why I brought iron, obviously. All right. So those, I thought, I saw these ones, and I thought, because they do look kind of like them, and it is nice that we have the conduit here. Okay, so there's one right there. And... Alright, I'll let him attack that guy. I wonder... There might... Could probably also do a different farm, though, now that we have the axolotls, because they do attack them. Uh, they do attack the guardians. But that is cool. So we have our first axolotl. If I can get him. I got grab water. No! Okay, thank you. So he should be my pet. And I gotta be careful. Because they could be out of water for a few minutes. I want to say it's like three. Three to five. Oh. Three to five. I do have a trident, but... Actually, I have dolphin's grace, too, which is cool. If this dolphin will follow me, we could quickly hit this guy. Dude, really? <gasps> Dude, sweet. Look at that. Copper ingot. Look at that. Sweet. <laughs> nice. We're already getting the good stuff in survival. All right. So we have one. Is there? There was another one. I know there was another one. There it is. I will save you even though you don't need me. Ooh, glow sweat. <gasps> oh, there's a brown one. There's a brown one. There's a brown one. No. Ah. Uh, what do I do? What do I do? Are these two the same? They are pink. All right. Can I? I can't release you. Why can't I release you? Why? I can't release you. Hmm. Hold on. All right. You are released. Now, are you my friend, though? He might be. All right, where is the brown? There it is. There it is. And then the blue, there's a blue one, which is hard to find. Hey. No. Hey. 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 Yeah, he'll drop me. He'll drop the glow, glow sacks. Okay, they're still pink, but this should be. Yeah, yeah, okay, so it says it. So there's the cyan. There's the brown. Hopefully, I think the two, the other one that I let go was a cyan. So we have glowing sacks right here. This um, We'll get to uh, the amethyst geodes at some point in the video. but Okay, so cool. Just by coming right to this spot, we've encountered axolotls. We got, we got first copper ingot. We have glowing sacks. Um, yeah, okay. I want to actually look underwater. So there's a pink one. Why? They are supposed to spawn in caves, though. I really thought that they were. And that other axolotl is that one? I'm guessing it's that one. And I don't know if he is my friend. So if I get hit by one of these dudes, will he come and rescue me? Alright, that actually kind of hurt a lot. I'm actually going to get out of here before I end up dying. And certainly I'm going to put these in uh, my ender chest. Glow squid, sweet. We can make some nice looking signs. So I'm going to stick... I am full right now. So we have two out of these. Lots of ideas, lots of new things. 
in the game. Alright, axolotls. I guess I'll put you guys down here. We'll start to breed you guys. We'll actually we'll probably add you guys to the aquarium. If we have room. We have the glowing sec and then our first chopper ingot. Right there. Wonderful. And that's it. Okay, cool. And that's my last ender chest so far. I think I have other ones that are around. It is nighttime. So I've got to be a little careful. And what do I not need? I don't need bones. I guess one slab won't really do much at all. I guess I need dirt just in case I need a pillar up somewhere. And Enderman, I don't know, you kind of scared me. All right. We'll eat, heal up, and then we will continue the journey. And good thing I brought night vision potions. Because I can see. I don't know if I've been to that one, but I'm pretty sure I have. There shouldn't be any new structures around me at the moment. It is nice, though, because the conduits almost give a full night vision sight, which is cool. Yeah, so there's the creeper farm. Why is that? S I don't know if that should be taller. I don't think it really matters, the height, because I am out in the ocean. And I probably need to make my tower higher than that, like 20. It's a work in progress. I haven't actually built a creeper farm yet, so yeah, hopefully it'll go well. And I hope I don't get lost out here, but I should be fine. If I need to, I can turn coordinates on, and I've been out this way. I found this second temple, and then the coral reef is right there, this large coral reef. Now, glow squids. I wonder if I could just kind of see them. But yeah, that is... I guess they're kind of still getting worked on because I am pretty sure that those are... Axolotl and the glow squids are supposed to spawn in underwater caves. Or caves in the water. Oh, great. Nice. And I believe the axolotl can help me with that effect too. I should have brought my Alicia. This would have been so much quicker. Ooh, look at that. More. More, more, more. That is neat, though. I guess they could have spawned there and then come up here. It's cool, though, with the ink. It's, it glows. There we grab both. No, it's floating up to the surface. And then yours I can grab, though. You've actually lodged yourself into this coral. And four more added to the pile. Five. Ooh, three out of that one. Okay. Sweet. Cool. Good stuff. None on we go. And I don't have any more iron. I guess I can mine some if we end up finding another axolotl, but I do have brown and cyan. I know there's a yellow one, and then there is a mix between a blue and white one. And then there is the actual blue one, which is the hardest one to get, which you have to breed for. But, yeah, we'll get to that one eventually. Okay, so this is the island I'm hoping. I'm hoping it's the island. And that's. I should probably pop a night vision. It was kind of lagging there. Alright, so that's a boat. There's another boat. That's a cool looking boat. It looks like it's daytime right now. I don't know if I've been to these. I don't know. Basically, I've just pretty much gone straight. And I guess I could quickly pop into this one and see if I've ever actually gone into it at all. I don't know if I have. Let's see. 
there's anything that we haven't grabbed, we'll know. Alright, so here we go. I believe this is where it is. Nothing there. Uh, should be good on breath still. Come on. Chest. Treasure map. And I guess I'll grab the feathers. Is that it? Really? Is there no other chest? I must have been here, I'm guessing. Because usually there's a chest in here. Yeah, I guess I've been here. I don't know. I don't know. Unless this one just actually didn't have one. Alright, so where's the boat? Here's the boat. Grabbing in the boat. And there's some more <laughs> glow squids right there. Alright, on we go. Traveling across the ocean. And search for a round object that looks oddly shaped almost like that one straight ahead of me. Ooh, there it is. There's an amethyst geode right there. And a sunken ship. So I guess I haven't been to that one. I want to see if there's moss in this one too. I want to see. Give me the moss. Swim straight down. I'm stuck. Why am I stuck? Why am I stuck? Why am I stuck? Dolphin. Why can't I go down? Uh, treasure. Where is it? No treasure. How is it? Really? No treasure. Hmm. How is that the case? Really? Is it down here? In the cave? And I should pop a water breathing. Anyways. My bubbles go back up. Alright. Just swim because it's looking. Ooh, look at that. What do we have here? Okay, I have water breathing. This should make this quicker. Wow. <laughs> really? This is taking a while. This is like mining obsidian with my pickaxe right now. Actually, I think it would be quicker. Really, this is taking a while. Why is this taking so long? You're only glow lichen. Really? Really? <laughs> we have to get every single... Yeah, okay, so that's not how you mine those. You actually probably need shears. Which, I have she I have shears in one of my... Drown, get out of here, please. I know fire... Oh, did you drop? No? Okay. I was checking, maybe you dropped copper, but you didn't. Alright. So there's another drown, and there is the amethyst geode. Let's slowly swim on over. So this stuff, is this blackstone? I don't think it's blackstone, is it? What is this? Smooth basalt. Okay, so we have basalt. And then we have this beautiful calcite. Okay, so calcite and basalt. Basalt is not new, though. Unless this block is new. Okay, and there is our first amethyst block. I don't really know what I'm going to do with it. It is a cool looking purple, though. No, I just do not. Oh, okay. There is a lot of bad guys in here. A lot of bad guys. And there's a golden uh, the yellow oxalotl. Oxalotl. I don't even know what I said. Oxalotl. Why are there so many? Why are there so many villagers? Hey, buddy, you look cool too. I have your friend. If you don't go anywhere, you should be fine. And you are technically touching water. I didn't even need to mine down in here. <laughs> I don't like that this this water here though. I would like to collect all this though, all the calcite and basalt, and then collect up all the purple around it. And there isn't actually too much of the, what are those? I don't want to mind, I don't want to mind those. And then I need this pickaxe, gently mine this up. And that got me eight amethyst shards. So, this is actually a small one, but this is here, and I should mark this out. 
just so I can find it. Yeah, it's a lot of blocks to actually kind of my uh, build up to. But we'll do it. We have some cobblestone too. And I guess if we get above the water, we could just break the rest of it. We'll get a little ways up to kind of mark it out, and then we'll just do a T. Like so. Not across to get here, Bind. Alright, so there's that. And I should probably collect up the rest of the dirt. Just so we can use it, just in case I find some more. Let's break it all. So that's cool. So we found Amethyst Geode in my old Minecraft world. Nice. Now, I don't want to travel too far around. Because I know they are going to update the caves even more to part 2 in 1.18 and those will get larger caves and even more the deep the deep dark or the yeah is it deep dark I think it is um, but yeah so I don't want to travel too far so there's a sunken ship over there or a shipwreck and now all these caves should have some copper ore in them if if they do but so this is all newly generated terrain that I haven't been to and I do want to kind of leave my boat here I mean I have that marked out all I need to do is basically go straight behind me eventually I find so there's a ravine down here I don't think there's really anything down there as far as uh, I see some gold down there alright so there's this ship I would like to get some moss if I can <gasps> Ooh, dripstone. Oh, I need that stuff too. <laughs> Come to me, dripstone. I should have my trident out. Whatever. Because fire is not really good. I mean, at least you guys are slow. You just kind of sneak up behind me, though, which is kind of annoying. And then when a herd of you all kind of pack up together, rotten flesh kind of. That looked different. Oh, 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 oh. I need. I don't have water breathing. <laughs> Let me swim up. Uh, there's the uh, glow lichen. I should set up. I know I have. I want to say I have shears on me. I want to say I do. Okay, this is going to take forever, so let me just travel over here. Oh, wait. Those are, are, those, those are glow lichen, too. So there's some glow lichen right there, too. Kind of out on the surface. That's neat. What happened here? What is this? What happened here? Was I here? I don't think I was here. I don't know. Alright, so what we need is a chest right here. And I do have shears. Oh, would you look at that? And, yeah, I guess I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll do shards because I don't want to lose those. And I think that's good for now. And we'll grab some of this glow lichen right here. Yeah, this is mining quicker. There we go. Get some detail in my caves. It's nice that we have so many different kind of vine blocks now. Yeah, so they are giving off a little bit of glow. It's not as much as torches, but... Yeah, see, look, like, look at this. They want to come behind you just to sneak up on you and ruin your day. And there's some copper ore! Uh, what are you? Obviously you're dry. <laughs> How did I? Not, I don't even understand how I. I was even paying attention. Oh, I'm gonna drown. No, oh, that bubble saved it. Okay. I like that we have light, and then it slowly gets darker. Hey, dude, where did you come from? Popping out from above. Look at look at that. 
some glow like in there. Dude. Get out of here. Just drop your copper. How about that? Thank you. Thank you. See, you just have, you just gotta tell them who's boss. You gotta you get it you just gotta show these drowns, you know? And then they just freak out and poop on a a, a copper ingot. Alright, glow lichen, glow lichen, and uh, how's that honest shell doing there for you, huh? I don't need it. You don't need to bring it to me. Just stand back, please, sir. And rotten flesh. Rotten flesh, glow lichen. I really don't need all these. I could just farm them. I just, I'll grab this set right here. Things float to the top so slow. At least they float to the top, though. It's so much nicer that they do. Alright, so we're back here. I need to eat. And we've done a lot. We've actually discovered and found a lot of new things so far. So that is that is awesome. Quite happy about that. So we got the glow lichen. We have calcite. And you know what I should do? Do I have a fresh one? And I do have a fresh one. Fresh uh, shulker box. So that's not where I wanted that to go. So what I'll do is grab a hold of basically all the new stuff that we obtain. And put them in a separate chest and kind of sort them out that way. And we have the glow, the lichen, the copper. Don't want to forget about the copper. And there is that. So there is that stuff right there. And there was a boat. But I think that's going to do it for today. So we'll leave that boat hanging right over there. And go discover that. And also look for some more amethyst geodes. Hopefully try to find a bigger one. But at least we found one. So we have that one marked out. And there could even be some more around here that I haven't even seen. Because apparently up to here, I guess, is where I haven't been to. In Lord of this Chunkin in this world. Which is actually not that far from my from my home. So that's pretty cool. So I don't have to travel too far. Just a quick trip with the Leecher Wings. Or even set up another portal here. But Well, that's going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed... This has been McBucksauce, and I'll see you guys in the next one.